Let's gritty our way to North Central College for the girls track and field indoor DVC championship. April Central comes in as defending indoor and outdoor DVC champs, and with this being the last meet of the indoor portion, the Hawks and the five other conference teams are ready to make their mark before going outside. Nequa Valley finished second in both conference standings last season, so Lauren Ammenhauser is looking to help, and she does by setting a new PR on the triple jump at 10.59 meters. Teammate Gabby Carvelis is back on the track, and she jumps her way to a first place finish with a jump of 11.74 meters. Her partner Zawadi Brown takes first place in the long jump. Now the gun goes off, so let's go racing girls, and we start with the 4x800 meter relay. Naperville North's group of Kayla Marks, Lexi Para, Emma Barris, and Julie Pio outpaced the whole field by almost 20 seconds. That's one way to start the running events on a high note. Up next is Liv Phillips, who leads the way in the 3200 meter run ahead of Shania Tandon. Mattia Valley's Camille Baker follows along with Ava Hendren, Rihanna Tandon, and Wobonzi's Catherine Heap. In the end, Phillips wins by 20 seconds ahead of Shania, while Hendren and Rihanna follow up. Hurdles are on, so that means we are running in the 55 meter hurdles. Brooke Sawatsky from Naperville Central is defending her indoor DVC crown, inching out Matias Ariana Hammonds with a time of 8.62 seconds, and that's a new school record. In the 4x2, Nequa begins their push with Carvelis anchoring the pack of Ava Bell, Lauren Ammenhauser, and Tanvi Guruvigari. This win gives them a spark for the DVC. To the 400 meter race, and here is Zawadi Brown leaving all the opposing runners in the dust. Brown sets a new personal record at 58.03 seconds. Let's race a mile, and you cross country viewers better recognize this duo. It's Liv Phillips and Julie Pio. The longtime partners go 1 2 in the race, with Phillips coming in first and pumping up the team score. Brown and the Wildcats keep on playing catch up. Brown's victory in the 200 meter dash is one of three individual races won by the senior. With that, the Wildcats trail the Red Hawks by seven points heading into the final race. For the 4x4 purposes, Central needs to finish at least ahead of Niqua. However, Lola Satri Morales has other plans, and that's bursting out in front and cruising all the way to the finish line to secure the DVC title. Naperville Central takes home its second straight indoor girls track and field DVC plaque ahead of Niqua and Matia Valley. I just really wanted to bring it home for our team because I knew it was a close like call between whether we would win or not. And I knew that second place would probably get us a lot of points, but I didn't want to leave anything up to chance. So I really thought I should just drive it home. Team culture this year has just been amazing. I think we've definitely all grown as individuals and then that just, you know, went into the team aspect and I think that we've all been working so hard during practice and we all just want to succeed and I think that showed tonight. Everyone ran awesome. It was so cool to see the whole team coming together. The 4x4 was amazing. You saw some really cool runners just stepping up there and it was it was really cool to watch. This is awesome. We're bringing in so much momentum. You know, we've had those past victories in conference, but it's really good to see that this new team is able to put the marks in that they need to and bring this momentum into the next season. Everyone did amazing. You know, we all did as best as we could with the with the stuff that we had to work with and I'm just proud of everyone that came out tonight and ran well. So the things we can learn from is just working together as a team first of all. Um, if someone's having a bad day or if someone's feeling sick, being okay and stepping up to that event that maybe you don't run as often. Um, I know that some people, they were uncomfortable with the events they were running in, but they decided to go out there and do it. And so just transitioning that into the outdoor season and being available and open if somebody needs um, you to step up for them.